What is going on everybody? Today, we're gonna take a look at the dual channel distortion from GupTech. Sorry, I'm reading their most recent uh, little newsletter here that came with the pedal. Um, so anyways, the dual channel distortion, let's take a look at it, shall we? Uh, let's get it pulled up and uh, talk about it for a minute. It is called the dual channel distortion. It is a low gain and a high gain channel. Uh, it's essentially stacking gains, okay? Um, I'm a big fan of stacking gains. I like the, the, the flexibility you get by doing so. Um, but we're gonna use it with the orange pedal baby. And we're also gonna use it with the Rivera knucklehead reverb. Uh, so it is designed, in my opinion, it is designed to go in front of a clean channel amp. Uh, I don't really like the way it sounds with the pedal baby. Um, mostly because it is acting as a preamp. Uh, but anyways, so we're going to use a PRS 245 SE, mostly because I've been doing some wiring to it and I need to make sure it works. Um, but this thing is, is fucking really underrated for what it is, right? So the top row of knobs is going to go with the left uh, foot switch and the bottom row is going to go with the, the right. Now your right foot switch is the on off. The left foot switch uh, activates channel two, all right? So uh, channel two can only work in conjunction with channel one. So your right foot switch must be on before that foot switch will actually affect it. Um, so it's not like it's too independent. Uh, you have the first one and the second one gets stacked on top of that. Uh, so in my opinion, the first channel is kind of like that uh, Silver Jubilee uh, JCM 800 kind of sound. It's kind of got that Marshall-esque crunch to it. Uh, and the second channel, when it's activated, it kind of reminds me of like a 6505 or a 5150. Uh, it's kind of got that same kind of compression to it. Uh, it's a very tight feeling compression, you know, kind of kind of squished in there, uh, but it reacts really good, uh, at least on the clean channel of the Rivera. So we'll get into that in just a minute. But... It's a fun pedal, it really is. So let's go ahead and check it out. So again, we're gonna go into the Pedal Baby first, then the clean channel of the Knucklehead Reverb. Here we go. So now let's go ahead and we are going to switch over to the knucklehead reverb. We are on the clean channel. No other boost on the amp is enabled. Uh, in fact, the only light is on is the green channel amp or the green channel LED. So here we go. Thank you. 
the dual channel distortion now like i said i really feel this pedal shines in front of a clean amp um or at least a clean channel I, it sounds so much better it sounds more natural than it did with the pedal baby uh so for example i'm just going to keep the room mic on i'm going to mute the iso cap Let's go over to the pedal, baby. Back over to the KR100. Yeah, it just, to me, it sounds more natural uh, in the clean channel. And maybe that's because it's already going through the preamp. Uh, I don't know. But tell me what you guys think. Uh, again, a huge shout out to GovTech because their pedals are really underrated. Um, and for what this thing does, you're essentially adding two channels to your amp. Um, so if you've only got a single channel amp like the Republic, I was using it with it. Matter of fact, uh, I think I have it. All right, so that's the Republic. All right, so that's the Republic. Uh, the room mic is still on. I'm going to go ahead and mute this. We'll go to the ISO cab. Yeah, so it just has so much flexibility, man. And uh, I, like I said, I really think that this pedal is very underrated. Uh, so anyways, tell me what you guys think in the comments. Uh, how do you feel it sounded? Where did it sound better to you? Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And be sure to check out Guptech and the rest of their pedals, man. They have some killer stuff. Uh, to be honest, I think their MWAC is probably the best noise gate I have played to date. Uh, truck driver Sean sent me over a couple of his and after playing through them all uh, maybe I'll do a shootout I don't know anyways we'll see you in the next video